normally do we have everyone yeah almost i think we are missing one or two but uh uh who are we missing maybe pierre uh maybe pierre but otherwise everyone is here captain is here okay yeah but andre he he he, he, he put it on the uh on Team Snap, that he was the only one not coming, Andre. Normally, we we should have eighteen players uh, tonight, but we can we can start. Uh, like I mentioned um, on Team Snap uh, tonight, we talk a little bit about you know, of course, the different games uh, that we had. Uh, we will focus about, of course, Cherry Beach, the game we had against them two months ago. A little bit about uh, Bryce and uh, and uh, York Jets. Uh, it's not a monologue, guys. I want Elan to talk. I want you to give some feedback and talk, guys. It's not just uh, me and Elan talking for 30, 40 minutes alone. Okay. Uh, let's start with the presentation. And we have some discussion during the, uh, during the, during the talk. Okay. During the presentation. Let me see. Entire screen. Okay. Let's do this. Uh, okay. So, the first thing I quickly, I just uh, I did a, a quick uh, presentation today that I wanted to uh, to show you. Uh, the, and I will ask you, of course, feedback as, uh, as usual, okay? So, we start with the first, uh, the first, uh, the first slide. Let me just take this off. Uh, here we go. So, you can still see my screen, correct? Okay, so as you, some of you maybe noticed on Team Snap and on the 2011 uh, Instagram that we have, I, I did uh, a small video just to introduce, you know, uh, the Saturday game. And uh, of course, it's every game is important, but I think this one is one of the most important one. It's not just because we play Cherry Beach. I think we want to see with Elan the evolution, you know, since we played them two months ago and the first game of this uh, GTISL league was like the uh, against them. So we really want to see how we improved during the uh, the season. Secondly, because they are, nobody beat them, uh, the last game they almost uh, uh, draw against Sporting Portugal. They just won against Sporting 1-0. So I think it's... Uh, I think it's the right time to play them again. And the third, why do you think uh, I did this video and why do I talk about a wolf pack? I want to have some feedback from you, either on the chat if you don't want to talk, but hopefully everybody wants to talk, or you just raise your hand and, and give us some feedback. If it's on the chat, Elan, if you can just uh, mention it to me because I, I can't see the, the chat. Yeah, yeah, go, 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 go ahead. I want everybody to talk. Wow, it's like uh, it's the perfect uh, description. Yeah, somebody else. Anything else to add to to this great description? Don't be shy, guys. Come on. Any captains? Yeah, no, it's perfect. If you check uh, the description or if you maybe you like the wolf, uh, they always travel, they always live as a wolf pack because they can't survive. It's the same for a football, you know, for a football team. You can't just play alone. Uh, if you play alone, like Emmet mentioned, you can you cannot survive. You can't do anything. You can't have a, a victory or a good result. So it's really important to be like a, a wolf pack on the field. And, you you know, the fighting spirit too, they, they always fight. Uh, for each other, so so that's why I use this uh, quick intro video on the Instagram and 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 tonight. But uh, good 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 feedback, thanks, uh, Emmet. Okay, analytics. Exactly. Remember, yeah, 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 yeah. Who said this? Who said this, uh, Elan? Yeah, who who said this on the chat, uh, Elan? Yeah, yeah, exactly, uh, Daniel. Like the three pictures that I show you a few weeks ago on the iPad, guys. We started as a cute puppy, uh, pu puppy, 
after some games against Sporting, we, we were more like uh, angry dogs. That was better. And now I can see like since four or five days that we are really like Pitbull, especially I will say your Jets and Bryce, Bryce especially because Bryce, we had just, uh, we didn't have sub basically. We just had this sub from uh, from the Woodbridge uh, strikers, Stefano, that was amazing. Uh, I, I told you about it, that the fighting spirit that he had, Ben and, and some of you during the world game, it was amazing. We we, we really fought against, against Bryce because... You know, they are first of the PISL league that is like uh, 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 basically the same as GTISL, but it's just outside of Toronto. They Nobody beat them. They had like, what, 15, 16 players this game. We just had 11 and, you know, we fought with, with what we had. First ball, second ball, everywhere. So so that was amazing. And talking about this, that is why I want you to show you some uh, fighting, uh, some, some analytics. And after we will talk about the fighting spirit. Uh, uh, Elan, did you want to add something or did you want to present something before for Sherry Beach or something else or, or I go ahead? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead because maybe it's more or less the same. No, go first, go first. If you want, I don't know if you want to share your screen or... Yeah, yeah, we can see uh the oh that's a nice guy in front of it. Oh yeah, that's me. <laughs> it was amazing. Hey, I would love to have this every game just to be on top and see uh, the full pitch. That was perfect. Oh and I forgot before Elan, sorry, before talking about this and I see uh uh Elis. This this game, first of all, like I mentioned, we were just 11 players and some of you guys, you had to adapt. Like uh, Captain Elis, he had to be centre-back. Uh, I think Max, at one point, he has to be centre-back too. Uh, so we had to adapt, you know, uh, and, 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 and we really did it well, really well. Yeah, go ahead. Thank you. 
position. Oh, poor guy. You, you know, it's always the same. And I have some key points about the fighting speed because this game, for example, Ben, I, I took two or three times Ben uh, that he had this fighting speed. I didn't take Stefano because... Uh, it's not part of our team, but the one, the, the, the players that were there, they saw it. Stefano is he, uh, not tall. He's a little bit like uh, maybe, uh, uh, I will say like, uh, yeah, he's a, he's a small guy, but he was fighting on every ball. He was like an angry dog on, on the field. He really helped us to to have this draw 1-1 one, one, one against uh, Bryce. So that was that was really good. I just have a few key points that I want to... Uh, to show you, can you just uh, share the screen again and, and go to uh, 5229, uh, uh, Elan? 5229. Yeah, this one, it's about how to reset. Guys, you see on the left, Simone has the ball. He will give it, so uh, 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 Ethan give the ball to Simone. In this situation, just up here, in this situation, Play fast, guys. Don't keep the ball too many seconds, especially against uh, uh, um, Cherry Beach. I'm not saying just to throw the ball, but in this, look at these two players. They were just focused on Simone and uh, Ben. He was completely alone. When you have this type of possibility, guys, don't overthink. Control, back uh, control, move forward, and the second or third touch maximum has to be the pass for Ben, this one we don't do it. We keep it. We keep it. We keep it, and you can play the the the, the action, Elan. You will see we will lose lose it. We don't. We don't. At this one, oh, we give it, and and it's done. A simple build up from the back, and we all they almost score, guys. This has to be done here. Bim. Now he has to give it, and in the same time, Ben or other player, he can be a uh, auto. Uh, he can be uh, Ellis on the left or right uh, midfielder. Drop on the line, you have space. You still have two, three meters behind you guys. Take the space. Yeah. Oh, that's... Uh, sorry. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. You're on the left. Sorry, Emmet. But it's... No matter what, it can be Ben. It can be Chiesa. It can be somebody else. This, we play... Guys, we do a lot of training. You Attacking using white space the first day. That's the type of thing. Even if the, here we are playing from the back. Take the space, take the line. You have a lot of gap. And the two players from Bryce, they were just focused on Simone. Nobody took Chiesa. He was completely alone. Chiesa, first touch, back foot moving forward, and you can drive in. You have easy 5-10 meters in front of you before deciding, okay, long ball in the width for TJ, or I play 1-2 with somebody next to me that can be one of the two pivots in the midfield or the advanced cam. That's it. Easy, guys. Two, three touches, and we move on. Okay? It's 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 quick. Sometimes you don't need to to uh, to be the, the 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 best player, or whatever. You just have to be smart and and make sure that the two three touches are relevant for for you and for the team. Otherwise, it 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 can bring danger like this one. Okay. Now let's go to a little bit the analytics against Cherry Beach. Uh, do you have the video, uh, Elan? Instead of me uh, going back and forth. No, you're on mute, but it's okay. And by the way, if you have feedback, guys, uh, during uh, the, I see that we are almost everyone on the call. Uh, yeah, go to uh, ah, that's the YouTube link. That's not the VO, okay? Because I have the minute for the VO, not for the YouTube. Uh, it's 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 okay. I will open. By the way, uh, hopefully before Saturday, guys, always check the game, the last game against Cherry Beach, okay? Even if we gave them gift, you know, we have this ponytail guy. That is doing everything he wants, but now we have Sam that uh, is ready to uh, to um, take him down. So we have this guy. But let me share my screen. So let's go on uh, on just some uh, some uh, key key points. Okay, you can see my screen, correct? 
Yeah. You get, yeah, okay. 2020, okay. So the first one, guys, it's a really easy one, uh, 2020. Here, guys, you will have, this is not about Cherry Beach. It's about all the teams we play and even us sometimes we play. How we play, guys? What's the situation here? The defense on Cherry Beach. Yeah, but how they how they are positioned on the field, Cherry Beach defensively. In the middle. Look, look the left. Look the left. If Emmet has the ball here, he keeps it a little bit. Look how the left was open. Every team they play central. Here, it's uh who's this? Elise. Elise on the left, if you give him on the left, is along. And this you will have the case again. Cherry Beach, your jet was the same. UMSC, it was the same. Sporting, every team, even us, sometimes we play really centrally and we forget that we have the left and right side. This one, you control the ball. Elise, hey man, got it. give me the ball, give me the ball. Scream on him, he give it on the left and that's it. You were completely alone, Elise. And, and just that's one situation, but it, it will be a, a lot of situations like this. Okay, I just wanted to show you quickly some of them. This one, be careful, guys. Not just them again, free kick, goal kick. Uh, every time they will have a, a possibility, they just do long ball. They don't play from the back. If you watch the game and uh, I will show you one or two clips, every time they have a goal kick, he was just throwing the ball in the middle. That's it. This one is a perfect example. They have a free kick. First, we don't come back. We are still looking at this player, guys. Look, uh, one, two, three, four, five. We have seven players just watching this player. And this one, long ball. It's a one versus one for Theo. He's almost alone, guys. And uh, if uh, Luca didn't go fast, it can be a one versus one uh, this time. Uh, so you have really to be careful. Theo, you know that you are the sweeper. You always play a little bit behind the two center back. It will be the same this time. You have to be the last, the last defender when there is a long ball like this. Take two, three meters, especially when it's a long free kick like this. When you have a free kick that is far away, you know that they will do this. They will do a long ball. So you can take one, two meters behind the player because especially if he's fast. Uh, I know you're fast, but you can be the first one to clear the ball on the side. Okay. So that's really important uh, for you. I continue 27, 35. Look. Just long ball. They can play from the back. They could play the guy on the right side. He was alone. No, it's just long ball. And it's a defender that is doing the long ball, the, the kick. You see? They just do long ball. Middle. They will do this during the whole game. That was the half time. But they will do every... They, I don't think they will change. I don't think they will play from the back. Let's see. Maybe we can, we can correct this during the game. Let's see how they adapt. But I think they will just do long ball. Another one, guys, free kick again. That's for us, guys. That's something that I saw against Bryce, your jet. Guys, when we are in the back here, we don't have to shoot a long ball, guys. We have Pierre that can give it to uh, Obama that was on the goal, but can be Ethan. When Ethan receives it, as soon as he receives it, he doesn't have pressure. Uh, Hudson, Kai, Simone, name, wh whoever you want spread on the wings on the right and it's wide open you look at the radar on the top right nobody's pushing you don't don't throw a long kick like this for no reason guys we did it we lost the ball we lost the ball okay so so take your time guys if you see you don't have pressure you don't have red player or whatever next to you play to pierre pierre drive in Play after to Theo. Theo, you drop on the right side to uh, to Pierre, uh, to uh, to Simone or Hudson or somebody, and you drive in, and it's wide open, guys. Don't complicate it. You don't have to just shoot a long kick like this, especially here. We are on the defensive side. If it's a offensive one and we are close to the goalkeeper, okay, try something. But here, no, guys, take your time. You you don't have to rush, okay? Take your time. Okay, the last one because Cherry Beach. Hopefully, you watch some games. You know how we play. You know them now. So this one, that's what it's good, guys. Just uh, play, play uh, one, two, play together, guys. You don't have to do long ball, okay? Play one, two. Of course, we lost it. And after it's wide open. This, you have to be careful, guys. Because as soon as they have the ball, 
they have good players that shoot from far away. You look at this guy. From here, he's trying to shoot. This Ethan, Ethan are you on the call? Is, uh, is Ethan on the call, by the way? Yes, no, maybe. Yes. Ethan? Can somebody can check? Ah, Ethan, did you have time already to watch some, some highlights of this game? Okay. So you will see, be ready. I talked about it and Elan and, and myself, we talked about it with you tomorrow, Thursday and before the game. When they have a the possibility, they will try to shoot. They will try to shoot. They have two, three goal, uh, two, three players that shoot really well and uh, they will try it. Uh, one of the goals that they score, it's a, it's a nice one because we didn't defend it well. But the score, I mean, it's, it's uh, I think it's, let me see, it's this one. Uh, let me see. Uh, no, where, where is the last goal? I think it's this one. Ah, no, 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 sorry. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I think it's this one. Yeah, that's the one. We, of course, we didn't take this player, so happen what happened after, but you will see. They are really good to score because look at this one. It's 20 meters away and that's a long, that's a long one, okay? You will see. They have two, three goals, especially the strikers. They are really good. And of course, the target number one this game for our friend Sam and uh, maybe the double pivot, let's see. It's Mr. Ponytail that I will show you that uh, yeah. because basically they scored two penalties we gave them. And where is the first goal? Mr. Ponytail, that's the one. Let me see. That's the one. I remember exactly. Long ball again. They don't build from the back. Goalkeeper has the ball. Pim, long ball. He can turn Ponytail and he has the stamina and he's, he's driving along. If Ethan is coming one on one against you or another player, do like Luca he was doing, he's going to him. He's not winning on the line. You know it now, but it's just, you know, I'm kind of repetitive. Just don't wait. Now it will not happen because Sam is aware. I like a Sam after when he takes the goal. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Sam, it's okay. Huh? <laughs> the, the two hands on the, on the head. <laughs> it's okay, Sam, don't worry. So you're learning, don't worry, okay? So that's really important, guys. I will stop. Huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. You saw them? Look, that's the thing. TJ, we play 3-5-2. Three, th three, I'm talking, but the defenders, they are really tall, guys. You will see, uh, look, they have th one, two. They have almost four big guys. I don't know how, how they play. I think they play 4-4-2. Four, four, I have to I have to figure it out still, but they have two centre back that they are really tall guys. Emmet remember because he lost the teeth. So but, yeah, but Emmet, when it happened, you go, you stop the game, you go and see the ref. You know when El Elan was talking about being nasty, when the other team when do a when we do a fault against them, they go directly to the ref. They are like, ref, what is going on? They did it during this game. We didn't. We went too nice. I just said to the ref. Look, my team, uh, my uh, my player lost the teeth. I told him, you have to tell them because this guy that came with the elbow in your face, that shouldn't happen. But they have big guys, yeah. So TJ, I know uh, with the speed, he can do something for sure. We have players that, we, that have the speed and the stamina. We can take them really easily this time, okay? I know it will be a big fight, but we can we can make it. You can still see my screen, guys. Okay, now... Let's go back to the presentation, okay? And if you have any feedback in the same time, uh, don't hesitate, guys, okay? Like I mentioned, I don't want to talk alone. Uh, let me see. Yeah, yeah, TJ. Yeah, now I'm getting there. It's a, it's a good transition. So, let me go back to my presentation. So, you can see my presentation. Easy. We went to the 3-4-3, to the 3-5-2. For those that missed the York Jet, the second game, and Bryce, it's not complicated. The only thing that it changed is that instead of playing wide on the attacking side, where we had in the past one player on the left and one on the right, we play more centrally with two strikers. We had this double pivot, so these two CDM. So it can be, for example, Sam and Obama. And in front of you, you have a cam, a number 10, that do the connection between the line of the midfielder CDM to the strikers, okay? 
So that's the big difference. In the back, we stay the same. Three center back that they are supported. Listen to this name, to this word, supported by the left midfielder and right midfielder. Because the last game against York Jet, the only ga ga goal we took, guys, if you remember, if you don't watch the game, it's a crossing from the left side to the right side where our right midfielder didn't drop at the right time and they score. Okay? So that's the reason I'm saying that the left midfielder that can be, for example, Ellis and right midfielder that can be uh, Emmet, Otto, uh, any name, because you have to, to be ready to play any position. They always support when we defend. When we defend the 3 5 2, it's more like a 5. So it's like a 5 4. It's like a 5 4 1, no matter what. It can be 4 that stays a little bit more uh, up front and one striker just on top. But the most important is that the left midfielder and right midfielder, they play as center back. Left back and right back. Okay? If we play on the left, the left midfielder will be the full back on the left. Yeah. Okay, hopefully you will watch the recording of this session later on, okay? Okay, uh, it's up to you, okay? Thank you. So it's really important that the three in defense becomes five. Okay, Elan, did you want to add something? Yeah. Any question, just let me know, okay? There is no good or bad question, there's just question. So if you don't know something, ask us question tonight, tomorrow, go on YouTube, put 352, how is it working? So, you know, with all the digital technology now that we have, it's really easy to understand, but we will talk more and more tomorrow, Thursday and before the game. Somebody has a question on the chat? Elan? Can you just check because I don't see the chat? No? No question? Okay. We continue. Okay. That's my favorite part. Fighting spirit, what is it? Okay. Before we go to this uh, few, uh, few videos, what is the fighting spirit for you guys? Okay. Just because we are losing by a lot, Sam? Yeah, exactly. Somebody else? No? Okay. So let's go to the 70.70. .70 is uh, 27. Yeah, somebody said something. Uh, if you can check the chat, uh, uh, Elan, because I don't uh, see anything. Okay. Uh, so, ah, it was uh, maybe a, a smiley. Okay. So, next one. About the celebration. Ah, what's the question? Mm -hmm. That's the thing, guys. If you lose the ball, the second ball, come back. I don't care that you lose ball because we always lose ball. That's okay. Every team, even the best team in the world, they lose ball. But at least they come back, they fight for it. You know, you don't let like the wolf pack, you, you play together. There is no like I'm waiting now for the ball and, and uh, I scream to the other one because I don't have what I wanted or not on the right foot, whatever. You just adapt sometimes and, 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 and we move together, okay? So if I go to the Breeze game, let me go back to my, uh, okay, 70, 20, okay. Okay. Oh, who's this guy? Oh, that's me. Okay. Let me see if it's the right one. Okay. That's the fighting speed. Ben, he had it. This guy wasn't afraid. He came. The other guy was flying. I think he's still flying until Toronto uh, Pearson Airport at this moment. The pass was almost amazing. Ben, 
but it was perfect. I love the fighting speed on this first contact. The guy has the ball. He's like, oh, I have time. Ben came like a train. Boom. Here we go. I have the ball. And after, it's almost a perfect pass. A little bit stronger to uh, TJ. Remember, guys, when you play with TJ, what is his, one of his skills, guys? Just tell me. His speed. Guys, he has the speed. So if he wants to, if we want to use his speed, give him into the space because here that's almost a perfect one but it's in his foot so he has he has to control it before sprinting with the ball so this small detail it's because the defender of Bryce come back and stop it if it was in the space like right now i if the ball come here guys poo, it's done bye bye hello goodbye good sleep it was done it was done nobody will uh, come back to tj a little bit up front Perfect. But the spirit, the fighting spirit of Ben on this one, I loved it. So continue like this, Ben. We told you uh, this after the game. You were uh, one of the men of the game. So that was amazing. Okay, continue like this. Next one, 76-34. 76, 76, 76, uh, 34. Again, Ben. Eh, he's not afraid. The guy is in front of him. He comes. Boom. Here we go. Take the ball and bam. Okay. Fighting spirits. He's not afraid to go. Okay. And after, of course, you have to support the team. But he was good because this guy was a big guy. This one, this defender for Bryce. But he's good, Ben. I love it. Fighting spirits. That was perfect. I continue. I have different one from you. And I didn't take every one, but I took some of you. Uh, da, 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 da. Let me see. Let me see. Uh, 50, okay. Okay. He's fighting, he's fighting. You see? He's not maybe doing sometimes the righteous, but he was fighting on this one. He's here. He could be like here. He could be, you know what? I stop playing. It's fine. Andrew is coming to help me. I have Luca behind me. I stop. No, 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 no. He's fighting. He's fighting. He's fighting. He's fighting. And I was happy. I was happy. I told him on this one. That's what I want, guys. You're not making sometimes maybe the right choice, especially at this moment. Remember, guys, this is the end of the game. They play almost 80 minutes and still Ben was going all over the place. He sprinted. Here he sprinted, first of all. Okay. He could be like, you know what? I stop. I'm tired. No, 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 no. My friend number eight, you will not pass. My friend number five, you're not passing. No, no, no. That's perfect. That's that's the spirit I want, guys. That's the spirit. Even if he was tired, he didn't complain. He was just fighting for the ball. That's that's amazing. Okay? Now I transfer to the York game. Uh, where is the York game? Let me go back to the York game. Uh, York, 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 York game. Okay. That's the, the 141. 41, 41, 41. Emmet. That's the one I want to show you, Emmet. Emmet on this game, he was uh, everywhere. I don't know what you ate before the game, Emmet, but that was amazing. You fight for the ball. Here, you see that you lose the ball. You are, okay, I'm coming back. I take the ball. I take the ball. I drive in. I support. And this one, we almost score. That was perfect. That's that's the spirit I, I, I like, Emmet. I, I could show you six seven highlights of him during this game he was everywhere left right side up front a defensive uh, midfielder he was everywhere that's that's really something that i like and the spirits on this one too it's the celebration uh on one of the goal that's the one basically because while it's good because of the fighting spirit from emmet on the right side we have this corner okay wait we have this corner okay so corner okay that's what happened. We are here. Dylan, control. Two touches. First touch. Boom. Beam. Done. And Pierre. I like the celebration of Pierre. I like it, guys. That's what we need. When you score a goal, celebrate with the team. Come back and we go for more. But you see, because of the fighting spirit on, uh, from Emmet on the, that started here, guys, on this throw-in, because he, he lost the ball and he's like, you know what? My bad. I come back and I will fight again for this ball. And he's here. He's here. He's the first one. He's five meters away, but he's the first one. And because of this one, guys, we had this corner and, and we scored this goal. Okay? So 
fight for the team, no matter what. This extra mile, this extra touch, uh, this extra uh, clearance, fighting spirit, bring something to the team. I'm telling you, you will see it. Okay? Okay, we're almost done. Reminder. Okay, some reminder. You can see my slide, guys, by the way, or no? Okay. I will put on the on the chat the Spotify playlist. I'm creating a Spotify playlist, guys. And now I don't know if you want it before a game, but we can have maybe for the beginning of a, a, a game, the first five minutes or for a training session where we don't have a game. If you have, you go to Spotify and you had the one or two song, please. Each of you, one or two song, no more. Okay. You had them into this playlist that I just posted on the chat. Okay, there is the link. You click on it. You, I don't think you need to have a Spotify account. I think uh, even without a Spotify account, you can just select a, a song. If it's not working for no, no matter the reason, just send it to me. Tell me the song uh, and I will post it and I will put it into this playlist. Okay, so uh, take your time. Maybe we do it. You let me know if you want some music before the next game against Sherbish because we are in Monarch Park. We have some space behind the, behind the, you know, in the racing lane. So you let me know if you want to to be focused into the game with or without music. But that's the link for the uh, playlist. Okay, I talked about it with some of you Monday. Let's see. I'm, I I still don't know the numbers, but for sure, if we win against Sherbish, guys, I will bring brand new shirts so it's up to you guys that's the deal that we have you and me i don't know at this one if i can buy uh, 19 shirts but of course but for sure i will uh i will bring new shirts for some of you if it's not the whole team if we win against show beach that's the big objective that's the challenge that i'm giving you guys against show beach okay third UFA recording, so I'm, I'm I'm recording another session Thursday. You know, remember the tactical board stop stand still, but this time I really need to to have you uh, engage and make sure that when I say stop stand still, you stop and we uh, and we take time to to do the coaching point. So UFA recording Thursday, we have the seven versus seven field again Thursday, so that's amazing. And uh, the other topic, it's the league. Like I told you, they. Uh, they uh, updated the link, so I don't know if some of you didn't see the ranking, but I will show it to you guys. Now, that's the latest ranking, okay? We just passed York Jets, and we are at the same point with Sporting. They just have a better scoring difference. I don't care about this. Of course, uh, Cherry Beach has 26 points, uh, Purple 22, but we still have four games. The four games, we play Falcons, Athletic, Sporting, and we finish with UMSC. So UMSC, it's normally three points. So we are 15. And after it's up to you guys. Up to you what you want to do, how you want to play against Show Beach, Purple and Sporting. We can finish top two. We can finish top three or top four. It's up to you guys now. I'm just showing you the ranking. And after, if you want to be competitive uh, until the end of this uh, season, it's really up to you. If you want to play for the team or play uh, alone, that's completely up to you. Especially when we play a game, guys, me and Elan, we can't do anything. You're on the field. You don't listen to, to what we are saying. It's really you focus with your 10 other uh, players and the one on the bench. Okay. So, but I wanted to show you this, that it's really important. Before I show you two last video, I just wanted to show you again. Conclusion, 10 things that doesn't, don't require talent. Being on time, making an effort, high energy when you come, you give everything for one hour, you stay positive, passionate, okay? Body language, good one. Don't scream on your teammate because you didn't receive the ball on your left foot or right foot or in front of you, whatever. Being coachable when the two coaches and, and the others uh, coach, if sometimes you have to, to be coached by somebody else, just say yes and try to, to learn. That's something that I saw from you that you're always uh, keen and you're always uh, ready. So that's that's perfect. The point eight is one of the most important. Doing a little extra, guys. Some of you, when I mentioned to Otto, Ellis, or the others, oh, coach, after the game, the next day, I went to to, uh, uh, to the train mill. 
Oh, I went for a run. Oh, I went to practice uh, 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 shooting. Oh, I went to do this. Oh, I went to do that. You can always improve, guys. You're doing this for you, not for the coaches, not for your parents. You want to do this because you want to improve. So do the extra work, even if it's snowing like today. You always find something to do in your house, in your apartment. You just go to YouTube, put uh, uh, exercise at home for football players, something. You have so many videos, so many, uh, so many things, so many uh, solutions that you can have to do this at home. Okay? Nine. Yeah, go ahead. Go to basketball. Hopefully you watch uh, the end and you will ready for two more. Okay. Have a good session, Max. Okay. Uh, Sam, Sam, Sam. I have to do something with Sam and Max. Okay. We continue. Five minutes left, guys. Number nine, being prepared. That's really important. Come on time. Cleats, uh, shin pads, uh, water is ready, food. Okay. Number 10, it's, I think, a mix of the point number 9 to 1, okay? Conclusion, don't be late or inform the coach. Rest when you have a game or sessions, bring some sports drink, foods. And on the right side, that is really important. You don't have to memorize all of them, but there are three important for me, two for the players on the field. What is it, guys? No, the... Uh, yeah, but the the vocabulary that I want on the field, guys. They are... Yeah, and Ethan, what is the third one for you? And the third one, there is a third one that I always ask you to say. No. Yeah, exactly. And, and the third one for you, uh, Ethan, is the one that I told you last time. It's to say, uh, yes, I got it, you know, just to assure that, the, you know, the defense, if you feel confident, the defense will feel confident, the midfielder will feel confident, and the striker will feel confident. It's it's all about relationship and, and like a domino effect, okay? Last thing before I leave you guys, two videos from one of the one of the players that i respected the most because i like his his behavior uh on and on off the field uh let me just uh yeah okay go cool. it's okay i do it quick here uh where is it okay so that's the first one guys it's an interview of zlatan ibrahimovic okay and listen to what he's saying. Normally, you have the sound. Okay, you let me know if you're... Is there the sound? Okay. So listen to what he's saying. I have two things, two two quick videos of him to show you. Okay, to, so you listen. So he's talking about his son training because his son is part of the Milan AC uh, team uh, with the younger. And so it's just, it's like he's talking to him. Okay. Ah, of course. Wait. It was the end, but they put an ad. But that was the end. So you do it for yourself 200%. Okay? The second video, that's the most important one for me. And I think you saw it sometimes, especially when we play the Monday, me and, and Elan. Especially me sometimes when I'm tackling you guys on the field. It's not to uh, to just to 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 uh, you know to show off on tackling. It's because I give everything on the field, no matter what. That is a friendly game, is a competitive game. That is like with friends against a team. Yesterday I tackled one of you guys when you were about to score. It's just because that's the mentality that that is really important that you have to uh, that you have to show guys. And the second video, let me just show it to you. It's forty seconds. Okay. Something that I published on my uh, Twitter a few weeks ago. 
Can you hear it? Okay. So that's the same interview. I just put it and just listen the mentality that he has on the field. Okay. Okay, that's it, guys. There is nothing else to say. It's just the mentality that you have because everyone has skills. You have skills. Bryce, players have skills. Cherry Beach, they have skills. Every team, they have skills. But the difference between sometimes a 1-0 one, one or 2-1 or a victory and a defeat is just the extra touch, the extra mile, the extra help, extra support, extra fighting spirit extra communication that you're bringing to the team. That's it. There is nothing else. It's just about this. If you play as a team, if you fight for the team, if you have this I can mentality, guys, you can do whatever you want. Not just in football, in your life too. If you have objective, like for example, me, I want to be a professional uh, football coach. That's the mentality. I know it will take time. I know it will be difficult. But if you have the right mentality, you have a plan, you will make it happen, guys. Okay? So this, I want to see it tomorrow. After tomorrow, Saturday, in one week, two weeks, one month, one year, no matter what. Okay, guys, that's it. There is nothing else that I wanted to, to show you. It's already late for you guys. Thank you for, for those that stayed. Did you want to, to add something, Elan, or anybody, guys? It's the time. I, I have a few minutes. So if, if you have something to, to, to say, guys, in the same time, I will share something else. But just just go ahead, guys, if you have something. I wanted to show you just one last thing. Go ahead, Elan, if you have something at the same time. Anybody else? Uh, I wanted to show you this quick video, guys, about Real Madrid. Ah. Uh, Wait, where is this video? I really wanted to show you. It was like uh, two seconds, but uh, give me two seconds. If you are not in the rush, guys, because sometimes you are like, oh, coach, why we are playing uh, two, three touches? And that's I'm not I'm not telling you to play like Real Madrid, huh? just uh, easy tiger, guys. But uh, just wanted to uh, show you. Ah, here is the video. You uh, somebody wanted to say something? No. Okay, that's the quick video. Look, uh, if you can still stay, here we go. It's just because sometimes you're asking me like, oh, why we play two or three touches, guys? Two or three touches, two or three touches. You see, it's not, it's Real Madrid, of course. Huh? We, we have to, but just because sometimes you question like, oh, why we have to play two or three touches, coach? You see, I think most of them players, they are playing two, three touches, maybe three touches. Of course, it's Real Madrid, guys. It's Benzema, it's Luka Modric, it's, uh, it's a lot of... Uh, uh, stars, but just because sometimes you question the coach, like, oh, why we play two, three touches, uh, coach? Just that's an example. Okay. On this, guys, thank you for staying uh, really uh, late. Uh, this time we passed like the 45 minutes. Hopefully that's perfect. I checked Team Snap, guys, and I saw for the game Saturday we have everyone. We have the 19 players, guys, for Saturday. That's amazing. That's something that I really want to see every time now. We have four games left. We have maybe a game, a friendly game. I put it on Team Snap this afternoon against the OPDL team of Burlington. 
just after the game against Sporting in April. I just put it on Team Snap this afternoon. So always check Team Snap or ask your parents to make sure that there is no update. But we will talk later on about this friendly uh, in a, against an OPDL team. Of course, hopefully we can play against our OPDL team uh, with Shine. Tell me, TJ. Yeah. Ah, Luca. No, 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 no. But uh, the one we played in the winter, that was just... Uh, um, it was a competitive team. It wasn't the uh, the OPDL team. This one, it's really the OPDL team of Burlington. Okay. So Theo is really active. That's good, Theo. Uh, hopefully, I see you uh, in shape tomorrow night, guys. Have a great uh, night. Thank you for for connecting tonight and uh, enjoy your night, guys. Okay. <laughs>